We'll go to Charlotte, North Carolina. Greg, welcome to the line of fire. How you doing, Dr. Brown? Doing real well, my, thanks. Uh, my question for you is how you consider yourself to be Jewish, although to me you don't appear to have any African descent. Can you explain that for me? Because on my, from my understanding, all of Noah's descendants were raised in or around Africa. So just explain to me how you feel like you're of the, the tribes of Israel and you don't look to me like you have any African descent in you. Because I'm of the tribes of Israel and the tribes of Israel weren't African. Moses' uh, brother and sister got upset with him because he married a black woman. Moses himself was not black. He was Middle Eastern. Yeah, so but, that's, but, that's but, my, D, my DNA goes back to there. But Noah's, Noah's sons were African. No, they were as, as, as a matter of fact, they were, they were Hebrew. Ham's name in Hebrew means black. It's not, you're wrong. That's, that's incorrect. <laughs> it means black, hot, and burnt. Yes, it does. It, it, and I, no, no, no. I, I challenge you, I challenge you to, to, to... Greg, it does not mean black being... Having to do with hot or Greg, what are you laughing at? Oh, how many I'm, years? I'm t- t- tell you what, quote to me Genesis one in Hebrew. Just start Genesis one one. Quote it to me. I well, tell you what, I I'll, I'll give it. No, no, t- I'm going to help you. I'm going to give it to you. Bereshit bara Elohim et Hashemayim et Haaretz for Haaretz et Tatoi vavohu. Okay, we just start there. Just because you can recite something to me in Jewish language doesn't mean that you're Jewish. Uh, no, 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 Greg, Greg, I know the Hebrew language. I've studied that it for decades. That doesn't mean that you're Jewish. Because you no, 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 Greg, language. Greg, 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 stop for a minute. Greg, stop for a second. Greg, stop for a second. You laughed at me when I corrected your Hebrew error. Why were you laughing? No, no, no. I didn't, I didn't feel like you corrected my, my error. Ham, like ham, does not mean black. Ham, okay. What it does, does it not mean? mean black. It means hot, it, but, it's, but it's not. It could well it go to an Egyptian route. Yes, it it does. does not mean black okay. and burnt. You're wrong. You don't even All know right. Hebrew, Greg. You have no clue about what you're saying. I'm being yeah, frank with you. Well, right. yeah. You have okay, no clue that, about what well, Hebrew, well, the Hebrew language. So why were you laughing when I told you the truth? I'm, okay. Well, let, let's 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 refrain from that, and let's let me ask you this: yeah. Is it is it true that all of all of Noah's sons were from? The African region, let's say that. No, no, it's not true. They're from yeah. they're from the land of Israel, from the Middle East. No, 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 no. And they, they, they were dispersed from there. The, the, the flood did not take place in it. The flood was a worldwide flood, okay? But where the, the, the ark came down was in Turkey. That's north no, of that, Israel. It's not Africa. It did not come down. It came down in Turkey. And yes, from no, the there, the human race the spread around the... Inter- the history, the, the history of the Israelite nation began in Egypt. No, it did not. It, been, it began Brown, in Mesopotamia. Greg, Greg, Greg. Hang on, hang we on. Can, we can agree well, to disagree. There's nothing to disagree on. The Bible says it. The Bible says that Abraham is the father of, of the Israelite people, and he came from Mesopotamia. That that's no. today would be Iraq. What do you mean, no? That's what the Bible says. Okay, okay so when you have... When you have when you have explorers like Richard Francis Burton saying that Egyptians are from African origin, but the children I mean, of Israel are not Egyptians. They, <laughs> the children they, of Israel they, are not Egyptians. They, they went into they exile were, they, in Egypt they, because they lived in the land of. Can- no, they did not. Or right, well, Greg, That's hang on. Like I said, so you don't you don't disagree. No, there's nothing to disagree on. But you don't believe the Bible. That's the problem. No, Greg? I definitely believe the Bible. But what I'm thinking but is, but is Greg, that Greg, you're, Greg, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm not changing anything. Start reading the Bible in Genesis, the end of the 11th chapter, with the calling of Abram from Ur of the Chaldees, which, is, which would be Babylonia, Samaria. Okay, then he comes, he comes from and I, there. And I tell and then you to co- read Genesis 49, 29 through 30, when he says that they're from the land of Canaan. That is the land of Canaan, Canaan is not That's the not- land of... Abram, Greg, Abram starts in Mesopotamia, God calls him into the land of Canaan, with his, which is north of Egypt. The Egyptian people are not Semitic people, okay? The Egyptian people, they are Hermito-Semitic, but they are not primarily Semitic people historically, all right? The children of Israel are Semitic people. They came from Babylonia, from that, they came into the land of Canaan. They went into exile in Egypt, and they came out of exile and went back to their homeland in Canaan. They are not Africans, okay? They're, they're, they're Middle 
Easterners. So that's that's my DNA it traces back to that. So I I, <laughs> I don't want to be rude or insulting, but no, the, the Bible is okay. Me in, in any oh, okay. Way, the Bible's a hundred percent clear on this. I mean, there's no there's no question about the origins. Middle Eastern Semitic people speaking a different language than the Egyptians would speak, and not of African descent. So, so Jacob I, didn't change his name to Israel. God changed Jacob's name to Israel. Yeah. Yaakov okay, okay, to Israel. Okay. Okay. Now, <laughs> would, I think you're. I think you and I are confused on two points, and and uh, maybe it's me <laughs> that's confused. But like I say, from my understanding, all of Noah's sons lived and resided in Africa or around that region of Africa. They started and, here. And, and, where and, and, where where is the mountains of Ararat? Where did the ark come down? Hold on, hold on. Let me let me finish my point, Doctor Brown. So so. When all of the all of the, the 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 people in that region, when when they were so called, uh, would would you say when they were enslaved or whatever, you're telling me that they came out of Egypt with with no background from I mean uh, out of Israel with no background from Egypt. Yeah, they went into exile. They went into exile in Egypt, which is a foreign land. And they were slaves there. They didn't intermarry with the Egyptians. They were considered a par to the Egyptians. And then God delivered them, and they went back to the promised land, the land of Canaan. And then Egypt was an enemy of, of Israel. Hey, listen, though, Greg, uh, <laughs> I got to run. I appreciate the call. And, and look, we're one in Jesus. If we love the Lord, we're one in Jesus. And, and uh, as, as Billy Graham once said you know, to a black audience, he was, he was lighter than you and darker than me. You know, he's a Middle Easterner. But we're one in the Messiah, and uh, I have nothing but honor and respect for, for my black brothers and sisters in Jesus. Uh, but anyway, please, just, just go back, read Genesis through, and I think you'll get it straightened out. Thank you for the call. Thank you for being respectful, sir. I appreciate it.